All right, here we are again making this video. Um, and I'm making this because some people were struggling to find some action figures and some were saying that they weren't even in the locations they said they were. So I'm gonna remake the whole video on a new character and everything like that. So I shouldn't miss any action figures because I have the exact location to where they are now. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and move on to the first action figure. All right, now this one is gonna be here on the map. Come to the back of this hangar. You just walk in this door, you walk back through here, and there you go, there is the first one. All right, now this one, it's right here on the map. It's really close to this. You'll see this little like uh, F1 car on the map or the Nexus Laws in this customs right here. And you're gonna find this little ledge thing right here and it's just right here, as you see. All right, this one is gonna be right here on the map. On the, on the dock area and you're gonna see this little like square right here with this little building in the middle of it and it's also next to the bridge is what it looks like next to me next to these gas pumps you're gonna go up here and this little area and then there it is just right in here right there all right this one's gonna be at the dock area so in this little long strip right here and if you look at the map it'll be this long building and just at the start of it you're gonna see this little bug star sign right there and I gotta do is just go in here and there it is right there all right this one is gonna be really close to the dock just on the other side in the Merriweather area this is it on the map and we just go in here then right in this little like control area just make sure you don't die from these guys you pick it up and there you go and I died. Okay. This one is going to be at the bottom right of the map. And this little like sandy-ish area. And it's going to be right here at the very end. Where this little rectangle box looking thing is. And you're going to go inside. And right in here you can see right there. On this broken bus. And then there you go. There's your sixth action figure. Alright this one. Is just going to be right above here. Right next to this arm wrestling. It's going to be this rectangle right here on the map. Show it again. You're gonna find this building. You're just gonna walk over here. Then there you go. There is your seventh action figure. All right, this one is gonna be next to this ammunition store on the map. It's gonna be the second one. So if you go from one to two, it's right here. And I'll go ahead and drive back to where it is, just so you guys don't get confused in where it's at. And there it is right there. Alright, this one is kind of far away from this ammunition. It's just on the other street. But this is it on the map right here. Basically, is this road right here. Sorry about that car line in the background, but it's right above this arm wrestling thing. And this is the surrounding right here. So if you see this, you just walk in here. And there it is right there. All right, this one, here it is on the map. It's actually at this gas station right here. So if you go to the 18th one on the map, then, well, there, there's what it is. Now, this is going to be the same for every gas station location you go to, but you're going to go inside, and you're going to go to the back, and then there it is. There you go. All right, this one is going to be on Franklin Street, so basically right here, next to this G if you have it. Uh, but here it is again on the map. And you're going to find this yellow house right here, and just right in this little doghouse, you will see an next action figure. This one is going to be right here. Here it is on the map again. It's going to be under the highway, and the best way to find this area is just look for this curve of the road, or I guess the, uh, the shoe store right here. And if you see this little area, the gas station's right there. You're going to go this way. If you have a car, that's going to be better, but if you have something that's flying, or up an atomizer, you're going to have to break a gate or fly over it some way. And then, as you see, right there, there is the action figure. Alright, this one is going to be right here. Where these two roads basically make a point. That's the easiest way to find it. Now you're going to see these two sinks. And as you see, here is your next action figure just laying on the sink. 
This one is going to be in the canal area kind of thing. And if you just follow the canal from like here all the way down, you're going to find it come to this point where it splits into two. And if you get here, you're going to see all this construction going on over here or whatever. And right here next to the water in this little uh, scooper thing, I forgot what it's called. You're going to see the action figure. All right, this one is going to be right here. Right above this tattoo parlor area on this little corner with this little road going making an L shape. And here it is. The gas station is to your left right there. And if you see this fire department store, you're at the right or this fire department, you are at the right area. If you just go inside, then you'll see the action figure on the shelf right here. This one is gonna be over here at the news headquarters on the right side of the map. You're gonna see it is a very noticeable place. When you come up the road. You just gotta go inside, and you're gonna go to the left. You have to drive through these gates. Go up these stairs, and right over here, you have your next action figure. Alright, this one is also at the right side of the map, right above the news headquarters, and it's gonna be at this store, so it is 5 out of 20, so if you just go through the stores, you will find it. And as every other store is going to be, you go into the back of it. And right there, action figure. This one is going to be at the dam. If you don't know what the dam is, it's right here. If you just find this little body of water right here, you'll easily be able to find the dam because it's right here. Or you can find this road, go up it, and then there you go. But you're going to come to about the middle of the dam where you see this ladder and these stairs going this way to the right. And you're just going to go down these stairs. Go down even more stairs and then to your right you will see an action figure in the corner all right this one is going to be at martin's house and if you have his m on the map it'll be really easy to find it but this is basically his house it's really easy to find it either way basically gonna go up here you're gonna go to the left Behind his house, you will see right here in this little like bar stand area or whatever this is, you will see your next action figure. So this one is gonna be at the Vinewood sign. This is it on the map. Go straight from left or straight left from Martin's house, you will see this little kind of road that comes to an end here. And when you get to the Vinewood sign, it's gonna be the third letter, so the N, and you're just gonna go all the way up the ladder. And then here is your action figure. Alright, this one is also very easy to see in the map. If you go straight down from the Vinewood sign, you're going to get in this little, like, stadium area kind of thing. And when you look at the front seats, there's going to be your first section, and then your second section. And when you go into the second section, you're going down the middle of them, and you pretty much should just see the action figure flashing. Should be pretty easy to find it. Alright, this one is going to be right next to the casino, so if you just see this little icon right here, or the music locker, or whatever, it's going to be right in here, where these little, three little buildings are. When you see this, it's going to be the little biker gang area. It's going to go over here, and this little garage, when it opens, you will see your next action figure just on the shelf. This one is going to be right here, right below the casino. If you just go down a little bit, you'll see this little body of water right here. It's going to be right in this little building right here, this little square. And once you look at it from this angle, you'll see two sinks, and on the right sink, obviously, you have your action figure. So this one is going to be in the sewer. It's right here. The end of the sewer right here. There's actually going to be two in here. So I'm going to put these two together since they're both just going to be down here anyway. So if you just keep following me. When you get up to this, you'll notice it pretty easily, because you'll notice the action figure when you're driving through here. So there you go, there's your 24th action figure. And the 25th one, if you just keep driving down the sewer, you will find it eventually. Alright, the next one is going to be right here. So when you get up to this point, watch out for this gang attack, because it is really annoying. You're going to go up to this action figure, pick it up, and I would recommend reversing or whatever so you don't get in the gang attack like I just did. 
All right, now for the third one, just keep driving further in. Just follow where I go. You can make sure to follow this subway here. And when you get up to here, it should... Oh, it's actually right over here. So when you get up to this little area, you're going to see it. It's going to be right here on the closer side. And there you go. There's your 26th action figure. This one is going to be right next to the canal. So if you just go right here, you'll see next to this Rockstar Feature Series. Next to this Bingo Clothing Store. And just down this alleyway. It's a little hard to spot, but it is right here. This one is going to be next to this Los Angeles Customs right here. So it's going to be the first Los Angeles Customs if you're going to scroll through them. And right next to the bridge down here, you're going to see this little like control station. And just right in here, you will find your next action figure. So this one is going to be at the back of Maze Bank. And if you don't know where Maze Bank is, it's right here where this, this little like road kind of curves. And if you go to the back of it, you will see this little thing kind of going on. And if you see these, there's like waterfall things, then that's a good sign that you're in the right spot. You just go all the way up here to this middle one. It should be at the very top of it. And there you're, there is your action figure right there. All right, now this one is really close to the last one. It's going to be right here in the map, this little area. It's going to be the Arcadius building. This one is going to take a little bit to get because unless you have something that's like a flying vehicle, you're going to have to walk all the way up and just follow where I go. And your next action figure is going to be right in this little thing. Be laying right there. This one is going to be to the left, or I guess the top left of this Los Angeles Customs is the third one if you're scrolling through them. So it's pretty easy to find and it's in the middle of the city. So if you go to the top left of it, you're going to find this little road right here that goes to the dead end. And if you find this little gate thing, whatever, it's just going to be right here. It's going to be in a Vinewood house, so if you just come straight up from where you were, on this road right here, it's going to be this house right here. So just follow where I go. It's going to be right in here. I think I, I just picked it up. I don't actually remember where it was. I think it was like in this corner or something, but you should be able to pick it up pretty easily. All right, this one is going to be here on the map. And you will find this hardcore comic store. And as you see, it is right up there. So the easiest way to get up to it is you just go right over here. And let's see if I'm like a flying vehicle or something. It's going to follow where I go. And there you go. All right, now for this one, it's going to be right next to the movie theater on the Hollywood Street or whatever. So here it is on the map again. And when you see this alleyway, you're going to go down this alleyway. You're going to go to the right here, and as you see, it is right up there. So you just got to walk up these stairs, and then there you go. Is going to be right here next to this little body of water. It's pretty easy to see in the map because of its unique shape. That sounded kind of weird, but you know, whatever. Be right here. This little pathway right here. You're just going to walk all the way down. Then you will see your action figure right here. This is going to be right across from the one you just got. So right here. And right when you turn in here, it's going to be the first house on your left right here. You're going to go through these gates, then you're going to go to the right. And right when you get in here, you should see it just chilling right here on this couch thing, whatever the hell this is called. Alright, now this one's going to be at a playground. There it is on the map. You're going to find it at this curve of a road right here, just kind of in the middle of this little area. When you find this playground, you're just going to go up it, and then there you go. There's the next action figure right here, if I can somehow get to it. There we go. Alright, this one is going to be really close to Michael's house. It's just going to be right on this little road where these three little road paths stick out. And when you drive on this road, the second house on the right is going to go in here. And if you're in a car, you have to get out, but if you're in a flying car or whatever, 
I just follow my path. And as you see, it is right there. Should be really easy to see it once you get out on the tennis court. This one is going to be in the golf course, so just bottom. Go directly straight down from where you just were, and it's going to be the very bottom right of the golf course. When you come across this sign, this bench, and then you're going to see this action figure right here, this little like white cube thing, whatever the hell it's called. So this one is going to be at the movie set, and if you don't know where that is, it is right here. Road curves right here. Just gonna go in here, you're gonna go to the left, and right in this camper right here, you will see that there is an action figure. Right, this one is gonna be at this gas station. The one with the car wash, the only gas station I believe with the car wash. And you're gonna go in the back of it, and you should find an action figure back there. Alright, this one is going to be right here. I forgot what this is called right here, but it's going to be right next to this tennis area, the fifth tennis court on the map. And once you find this liquor hole store to the left of it, you're going to go down here. And then right here, you'll find the action figure between this ladder. This action figure is going to be right next to this gas station, not actually inside of it, but here it is on the map. When you find these stairs, you're going to go down these stairs. When you get down here, you'll see on this little dock thing, you will find your next action figure. This action figure is going to be right next to the beach. So if you just come right here, find this little circle on the map, it's basically right here. When you find this shark, you will see this action figure right inside the shark's mouth. This one's going to be on the pier, so once you come all the way down this road right here, and if you don't know where the pier is, on the left side of the map where these fair-go-round fair, fair rides are, you're going to go this way, just follow where I go. This little thing right here, the trash can, that's where the action figure is going to be. Alright, now this one, if you go from the pier right here all the way down, and you find these stairs, you're just gonna go down these stairs and just follow where I go. And once you get to this second lifeguard watchtower thing, you're gonna see your next action figure right up there. And this one is going to be next to this gas station, so the 16th one, if you're scrolling through them. And this little section right here, you're gonna be in this parking lot. And you're going to see this up at Adam Burger building right here. And you're going to go up these stairs. And just right here, you will find your next action figure on the very first table. Alright, now this one's going to be at the graveyard. If you don't know what the graveyard is, it is right in this little section of the map right here. Right next to this gas station. And when you find this church, this little opening, you're just going to follow where I go. Going to go to the right. And you'll see the action figure right here. This one is going to be right next to the golf course, so if you see this, you know, little golf icon right here, you're going to go right where this road is, next to this corner street. You'll find this fence, black fence, whatever, and you got to walk through it. You go through it and go in this little cave thing, you'll see your action figure right there. I know this one, if you go on this road right here, next to this gas station, just straight to the right. You will find this house, and if you go in the gate, you're going to go to the left. And you will find the action figure right... Oh yeah, right here. I didn't spawn in for a second. It's going to be right in this little, like, pole thing. Alright, this one is going to be at this H on the map for El Rubio or the Cayo Perico heist, whatever. It's pretty easy to find it. You're going to get to this house with this kind of entrance, and you're just going to go around this little thing. And you're gonna get out of the car or whatever you're using. You're just gonna follow where I go. You get to the back of the house, you will find these set of stairs, and you're gonna go up the stairs. When you get up here, you see the action figure is just gonna be on this couch right here. Alright, this one is gonna be at this area on the map. I kind of forgot what it's called. But if you go up this road, 
you come to here you should be right here and you're just gonna follow where I go and when you get up here you'll see your next action figure right in this little water thing right here and this one is going to be on the left side of the map right here next to this fourth tennis thing if you're scrolling through them it's gonna be the fourth one when you get in this parking lot it is from the road you're gonna go back here and when you get up to this bar stand you should see your next action figure right there All right, this one is going to be on the left side of the map as well. It's going to be at this gas station, the 12th one for scrolling through them. I'm going to go inside of it and go straight to the back. You can't come back here. It should be just right here. All right, this one is going to be at this gas station. It's going to be at the third one on the map. It's not actually inside of it, but it's on the left side, so it should be really easy to find. It's going to be the third one if you're going down this road. When you get to it, you're going to see this little dumpster. And it's basically just going to be sitting in this dumpster right here, as you see. Alright, this one's going to be really close to Fort Zancudo. This is where Fort Zancudo is on the map. It's going to be right here. Now, this is a gas station, but it's not like a gas station you can go inside of. But it's just going to be right here on this ice box thing. Alright, this one is going to be at this part of the map right here. It's kind of easy to find it. If you go straight to the right where you just were. It's in this kind of, like, mess of like roads I, th I guess you're gonna find this house on this road right here when you find it this is pretty much what it looks like and you're gonna see your action figure this little like plant pot thing uh, this one is gonna be straight to the right of the map or bottom right where you just were right in this little waterway right here and on this like curvy road that goes all the way up here when you get to here you should see this building right here and you're gonna go over here down these stairs and then once you get over here you should see your next action figure just chilling right here in this boat or this canoe thing whatever or this one is gonna be straight right from where you just were or top right if you just go straight over here you're gonna see this curvy road right here tiny one and it's gonna be at this part of the road the further part down or I guess the further part up I don't really know how you look at it but when you get over here, you're going to find this mine, and you'll see your action figures just on this table over here. Uh, this one is going to be right down from where you were. You're going to find this little dirt road or whatever next to the observatory right here. When you get up here, you're going to see this juice stand with the big orange ball, and you'll see it just right here. This one is just going to be straight up from where you were at this little turn right here. It's pretty easy to notice. It's about just like right in the middle of the map. If you come to this side of it or the other side, it doesn't really matter how you do it. If you're on this side, you'd go to the left here. When you find this green dumpster, your action figure is going to be right there. Now this one is going to be just right down the road so if you go down this road you'll find it. it's gonna be in this little area right here next to the vinewood racetrack when you come to it right here go from you go to this way and you should see it right there but this one is gonna be right below the prison and this is a prison on the map if you can't find it it's pretty easy to notice it and it's gonna be right on this road right here with this curve when you get over here, you're gonna find this little like house, the blue top and the white, the white of the houses on the bottom, whatever. And you're gonna find this dog house right here. And it's just gonna be right in here. Alright, this one is right next to that power station. It's on the right side of the map. I mean, this area, or not in this area, but it's gonna be right next to this area right here. When you get over here, you'll find this control tower thing, whatever. You're just gonna go inside of it, and you should see your action figure right there. Straight up from where you were, so if you basically just follow the train track you were on, it should lead you right up to here, which is going to be the dump area on the right side of the map. It's really easy to find it. Go over here, you'll find this control tower thing, just like the last one, it's going to be up in this control tower. It's not going to be in the exact same place, but it'll be right here. Alright, now this one is going to get the cops on you, but it's going to be at the prison. 
which is where the prison is right here and when you go inside it's gonna be the first tower to the right so just follow where I go when we get to this I believe it is all the way at the top so just keep following me when you get up here you'll see it's right there this one's gonna be at Sandy Shores Airfield so it's gonna be right up from the prison this is the airfield on the map it'll be right at the end right here when you get over here you'll see this control tower or whatever it is and when you go up it you will find your next action fee and it's just right in here there you go this one is going to be basically just straight right up or top right of where you just were it'll be right here in the very corner right next to this lake you'll find this yellow house so you're just going to go in here where this little like outdoor area is I kind of forgot and then the action figure is going to be right there Alright, this one is going to be at this gas station on the map, left of where you just were. You'll actually be able to see it before you even walk in there. It's going to be right there at the back. This one is going to be at the Los Angeles Customs in Sandy Shores. It's going to be the fourth one as you're scrolling through them. We get over here, we're going to go to the left of it in this door. And when you get in there, you should see an next action figure. It's going to be right here, actually. This one is going to be right down the road from Los Angeles Customs, so if we just go straight down this road, and this corner right here, or actually right here where all these trailers are, next to this arm wrestling thing, you're going to find four sets of trailers, and if you go from that one to the road, close to the road, it's going to be one, two, and then three, and you will see it on the third one right here. This one is going to be basically straight up from where you were, so if you follow this road right here, turn right right here, it's going to be at this section or whatever right it's gonna be at this house right here where these two roads come together and you'll see this boat right here and it's just gonna be right in the end of it this one is gonna be at the bikers camp and if you just go straight or uh, top left to where you were you'll find this little area right here it's really easy to find it you just follow where I go should find it in this toilet right here alright this one is gonna be right here on the map I kinda forgot what this building is called but it's right here we get over here you'll find this tree stump and just right here this one's gonna be right next to the military base and the military base is right here so if you just find this bridge right here it'll be at the very end of it and if you find this at the start of the bridge, you'll know you're at the right spot. And right behind here, you will find your next action figure. This one is also going to be right next to the military base. So if you basically follow the road you were just on, and at the end of it, you're going to take a right, and you're going to find this dirt path. And when you get over here, this first left turn, you're going to follow this left turn. And then when you get into here, you should find this little like dumpster thing, and then it'll just be right inside of here. This is going to be the last one right next to the military base, so if you go from where you just were, go around the military base, and you're going to find these two like circle things on the map, and it's going to be this one right here. All you got to do is you just got to go to the middle of it. You can already see the action figure from right here. This one is going to be the left side of the map, so if you just go straight up from Fort Zancudo, you'll find it right here. When we get over here, you'll find this building in the back, and when you go in it, you'll already see your action figure right here. I know this one is actually going to be a little island if you just go up, and you're going to see this bridge, and it's just right off the coast of the bridge or whatever. It's going to be the bigger island. Once you get here, you find this house, and then you'll find the action figure right next to the house right here. Alright, now this one is going to be at the Ultras Camp, or however you say it. If you just go right from the island, you should find this road right here with all these buildings around it. And when you get up here, you're going to take a right on this road. And then, this one is a little hard to get to sometimes if you're in a car like I am. If you just follow me. You will find this hole in the side of the mountain area thing, and right in there you will see your next action figure.
This one is going to be inside the Mount Chiliad Tunnel. If you don't know where it is, just go right from where you were. And you'll find this grayed out road that is just straight. And when you get to it, just follow where I go. And when you get at this door, it's going to be the second door you find. You should find sticky bombs and an action figure. So, there you go. Alright, this action figure is going to be at the sawmill. So, if you just go from the tunnel down to here, right on this road right here. You'll find the sawmill. Let's go where I go. When we get up here, you should see your next action figure really easily. I know this one is going to be at the lodge, or whatever. This is on the map right here. Maybe where these two roads meet. And you'll find this statue of a guy, or whatever, and right at his feet, you'll see the next action figure. This one is just going to be right up from where you just were on this road right here. If you just find this, it should be pretty easy to find it. It's going to be this house in the corner right here. When you get next to it, you'll find this little dumpster with the next action figure in it. Now this one is going to be right next to Beaker's Garage. If you don't know where that is, it's literally the Los Angeles Customs at the very top of the map. And if you just go right across the street from it, at this building right here. You'll find your next action figure right next to this garage. Now this one's going to be at the top of Mount Chiliad. Everyone should kind of know where it is. And if you don't, it's right here. You'll find this building at the top. And it'll just be inside of this building right here. This one is going to be at the very, very top of the map. Or almost very top. And there's going to be a gas station. It's going to be right next to the 19th gas station. If you're scrolling through them. But it's going to be at this little like circle thing. Should be pretty easy to spot. If you just follow me, you should be able to find it. When you get over here, you will find your action figure just in this little like sewer tunnel. This one is going to be right across the street from the one you just got. So if you just go right across the street, you'll see this little grayed out road right here. Which is going to be a dirt road. Find this little opening under the train track, and if you just follow me, you should be able to find it. Now, it should just be on this couch right here. It should load in. There it is. And there you go. And this one, if you just keep following the highway, you will actually find this road right here. It stands out from the rest because it goes a little long ways. If you follow it, you'll end up in this little dead end area, and you should see a house here and a barn here. And you will just find the action figure on this couch right here. Now this one is going to be at a barn on the map. So if you go straight down from where you just were, you'll find this road right here that leads you into a barn. When you find it, it's going to be this red barn, and you're just going to see the action figure right here. I know this one is going to be straight left from where you just were. So if you find this discount store, it's going to be the second one if you're scrolling through them. You will find this supermarket, abandoned supermarket, I think, and you'll find these windows in here, so you just gotta break these windows. When you climb in here, you'll find your next one in this vending machine. And now this one is gonna be right down the road, so if you just follow this road here, and then go here, and then take a left turn off of here. It's gonna be in these bunch of houses right here. Now, if you see the dock, that's good. If you're right next to it, you're just gonna go to the right here. It should be just in this tire right here. This one is gonna be at the lighthouse. If you don't know where that is, just go right from where you were, and you will find this road right here that comes to an end. When you get to it, you're just gonna go to the left of the house, and you will find this action figure inside this little doghouse right here. Now this one is right down from the lighthouse, so if you follow this road right down here, it'll lead you straight to the next one. It's going to be in this road right here that turns around. When we get here, it's going to be the house on the left, and you'll just see it right here. It's really noticeable. I know this one is going to be straight down from where you just went. It's going to be at Humane Labs, and if you don't know where it is, it's going to be right above the dump area that you went to before. When you get to the entrance... You're just going to follow me. And when you get up to this humane, uh, whatever it's called, forgot the humane word, you're going to follow where I go to get up to it. If I can get up to it. There we go. And then there you go. That's how you get up to this to collect it. 
I know this one is kind of hard to find, but if you go from top left of the Humane Labs, you will find this area right here. This already comes to an end, and you'll see this building right here. Now, it looks like a building you can't actually go inside, but if you just walk in here, you will find your next action figure right on this shelf right here. I know this one is going to be pretty much straight down left where you were. If you go on this main road, you will find this road that goes off to the side. And when you start driving on the road, you'll find this house to the left, and it'll just be right next to this gnome. Alright, now this one is going to be at the hippie camp. If you go from bottom left to where you just were, you'll find this little thing right here. that kind of like curves. It's right off the side of the main road right here. And you will find this car right here with a little UFO on it. And there you go. There's your next action figure. Alright, so by this point, if you follow my guide correctly, you should have 98 action figures. And if you don't, I don't really know what I could have messed up because I literally showed the exact location for each one since I was on a new character. Um, but if you have 98, you should be at this plane yard. Here it is on the map. If you don't know, it's right next to the 10th arm wrestling thing if you scroll through them. And if you just follow my path, it should be pretty easy to get up to the last two action figures. They're going to spawn on this red plane right over here. You got to climb on top of this plane. As you see, there's one right there, and the other one is right down here, inside this plane. Sometimes this one can be kind of hard to get up to, but there you go. That has been all the 100 action figures. Now, it's going to tell you to go to the Hardcore Comic Store after you get all of them, so just head over there when you get all of them done. Alright, so once you get over here, you're basically going to have to walk into the store. You're going to have a little cutscene. It'll take like 10 seconds, I think, or like 5 seconds. I'm not really sure. I don't remember how long this takes. Uh, but when you walk out, you will have this outfit on. It is the, uh, something rage outfit. I can't remember what the first word is. Um, you get 150,000, the impotent rage outfit, and an impotent rage haircut. Now, there isn't really much else to it. That was pretty much it. Um, I mean, you get 150 grand, which is pretty good. Um, but other than that, I wouldn't really say this is worth it if you want to do it for the money or, like, the outfit or anything. I really don't care about the outfit that much. I will go ahead and go to a haircut parlor or whatever, or a tattoo, or whatever the fuck it's called. Uh, and I'll show you what the haircut actually looks like. Alright, now this is what it looks like. I really do not like this haircut. It looks just so weird. Um, I mean, if you like it, well, there you go. Uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the outro. And, yeah. Alright, so if you guys enjoyed this, then uh, make sure to leave a like. Tell me if this is actually helpful or not, um, because I remade this whole video just because some people couldn't um, find some action figures, and I already knew that might have happened because I didn't have the exact locations of where they were, but now I do. I went through so much effort of having to remake this entire video, which doesn't take that long, but still, it's really annoying having to go around the entire map because I had to drive civilian cars the entire time since I don't have anything on this new character. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much been the video. Uh, if you guys want want to see like a playing card video, signal jammers, or locations of anything else, let me know. Uh, but if not, if I don't get any re responses to what I should do next, I'm just going to do what I want to do next. So I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.